The next award is the Tasmanet Best Software Product. I'd like to invite to the stage the Shadow Minister, Michael Ferguson. <laughs> Feel free to present the award as Steve Martin from the Pink Panther movies, that would be fine. That would be fine with me and I think fine with you, good people out there. It's a good mo. I did um, Movember when I was reading the news next to Penny Tame and uh, early on in the Movember thing and uh, much better than the effort I put up, hopeless. The nominees for Tasmanet's Best Software Product Award are ISW, and Secret Lab. <laughs> Michael, if you can do the honours. Thank you, AJ. You like our Jack Black. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it's a great pleasure tonight to be able to present this award for the best performing Tasmanian software product. And having been to their hiding place, it gives me great honour to present uh, the winner of the Tasmanet Best Software Product to Secret Lab. <laughs> Collecting the award for Secret Lab, Paris Butterfield Addison, who. I have, I've got that right? Is that right? Who, point, who pointed out before that uh, it's uh, Friday, not Saturday, I made a mistake earlier, so obviously has some sort of high-tech calendar app on his phone, so <laughs> congratulations. Paris, uh, I'll, I'll say the nice things about your business and then you can say nice things about what you've done. Secret Lab created and engineered the Play School Playtime application, it is terrific, for the ABC. The app instantly shot to the top of iTunes charts. It's number one on the iPad for an extended period of time, beating little known companies called Disney and Electronic Arts, that's so all. And the judges said, Secret Lab, obviously very talented guys at what they do. They're in a very competitive market, but the apps they produce are world leading. Paris, take the microphone and tell us why you're so bloody good. <laughs> For once, I might be a man of a few words and just say thank you very much for the award. Thank you to everyone for organising tonight. And let's really hope Tasmania gets the broadband it deserves in the future. <laughs> Sensational. And more Twitter followers than most people in this room, too, which I'm a bit jealous of. Heaps more than David O'Neill. <laughs> you can buy more, you know that. Tony Abbott bought a few hundred thousand, I want to say. He did it, he did it, someone did it to him. Gosh. <laughs> Keep it in mind. 